fighters on skis. Every year they race for a good cause. WMTW News 8's Morgan Sturdivant has the story of the woman and the family behind the 12th annual Mary's Fireman for a Cure. She was one of a kind. I always think of her. Mary Allen was a longtime mother, sister, wife, friend, and Shawnee Peak employee. She was also a longtime fighter of breast cancer. Part of her fight was the Fireman for a Cure race. You get a snowboard, you get a ski, you, you have fun with your friends, you raise money, and hopefully you end up finding a cure for cancer. Her vision was to fight uh, breast cancer and to um, have an event that ha hopefully would grow over the years. And it has. It's an exciting event. A lot of work goes into it, but it's for a worthwhile cause. It was back in 2004 when Wayne and Mary started the race. It started right here in the Sugar Shack. And it's grown to be one of the biggest fundraisers in the state. They've raised nearly $130,000 in the past 12 years. It's, it's just amazing that we've been able to continue it. it uh, a lot of people pulled together to help our mom, so to be able to help the others through her is unbelievable. Firefighters and friends from all over New England hit the slopes every year. Yep. And we always try to help out, and that's part of being in the brotherhood. And it's really neat the good support that we got. Although Mary Mary's fight with cancer ended when she passed away in 2005. Her memory and the people who love her continue the battle. And each year her footprint on that mountain gets larger and larger and she is thrilled to know that she has made a difference and she has taught her family and thousands of other people that you can make a difference and today is proof of that. In Bridgeton, Morgan Sturdivant, WMTW News 8. The Harrison Fire Department won the event this year. The latest totals for fundraising are $14,000 and counting.